who will be the candidates of the upcoming presidential election. Main political parties are yet to announce their presidential candidates. Political activists of the Podu Jana Perumuna express the following views in this regard. So far, it has been stated that Gothabe Rajapaksa will be the next presidential candidate. However, Mahindra Rajapaksa will officially confirm this. Everyone's making predictions. However, it is only on the 11th of August that we can see whose predictions are accurate. Starting from today, there is only another 148 days for the presidential elections. The presidential candidate from the Podujana Peramuna will be announced at the party's convention on the 11th of August. From the 12th of August, we will launch the 100-day action plan to end the present government. Announcing the stance of the Podujana Perumuna does not abide by the principles of political discipline. For the past four and a half years, it is with great sacrifice that we expanded our collaboration with 13 registered parties and multiple unions and reached where we are today. As the Podujana Party, we believe that we must proceed following discussions with fellow parties of the joint opposition. We are yet to discuss regarding the presidential candidate from our party. Many have revealed several names as the candidate. On the other hand, we are yet to form our alliance. We hope to hold discussions with Mahinda Rajapaksa this week. No, we are yet to meet and hold discussions and make a decision. This decision will be a collective one. There is an important point to note. It is the opposition leader, Mahindra Rajapaksa's statement that is important. What do you mean by an issue? The government brought in a new act recently for underutilized assets. If we decided to defeat that act and 32 members were absent, we will be defeated by 22. Do not debate over the presidential candidate. We will put forward a patriotic, people sensitive, and understanding candidate. Who is the candidate? Is it somebody known or unknown? What is the opinion on the United National Party's potential presidential candidate? Here are some views that were expressed today. Why are they putting forward a candidate that will definitely win? Is Mahindra Rajapaksa fearful that he has candidates that may lose? They have still not been able to say which Rajapaksa is contesting the presidency. Is it Gotabe Rajapaksa, Basil Rajapaksa, Chamal Rajapaksa or Shiranti Rajapaksa? In the past, Gotabe Rajapaksa prepared himself, even saying after the bombs that he will be president. But unknowingly, he has slipped down the slope. That candidate is chosen by Mahindra Rajapaksa's family. This is not the case in our party. We will present our candidates, but first, put forward your candidate. We are ready to present the candidate accordingly. We want a new candidate. We want someone new, who will punish thieves in both the former and the current government. In both 2010 and 2015, we were unable to present a UNP candidate at the presidential election. This is the party that gave freedom to this country and one that did the largest service. We must put forward a lone UNP candidate this time. All the parties that love this country will come together and appoint a common candidate. It could be Minister Sajid Premadasa. We will make the most suitable person the presidential candidate of the UNP. Ranil Vikramasinghe or myself do not have the ability to make that decision. That person will be selected at the appropriate moment by the working committee. Even Daya Gamage can contest the presidential election and win. 
There are several people in the UNP who are suitable to contest. However, from the Flavabad party, it will only be a person from the Rajapaksa family. We will have to wait and see. It will be decided by the working committee. We will announce it at the correct time. Even all of you must be left in some suspense. The elections commissioner has not asked for that candidate to be nominated. There is nothing for the UNP to panic about. As the ruling party at present, the president has to gazette the presidential election. We will move forward with our candidate thereafter. Who is the candidate? Is it somebody known or unknown?